fine. What's that? <sighs> Breakfast. Coffee and toast. Oh wow. So you now offer me breakfast. I have a maid, remember? I, I know that, ma. And I equally know that you never wake me up to make you breakfast. Because I know you feel that you're bothering her. Maybe I don't like breakfast. <sighs> Madam, I know that I'm just an ordinary guest, ma. But you've been so nice to me. And you pay me well as you pay me well too. I'm saying that you work so hard. You leave this house as early as possible and come home very late at night. I'm just trying to return the kindness. So you wouldn't let me drive you to work. At least allow me to do this. I'll feel much better knowing that at least you eat once in a day. Adam, are you saying I don't know how to take care of myself? Do you? Fine. I accept. On the condition that you will call me Lydia. But you... Your boss, I know. But it's not on your job description for you to prepare me breakfast, is it? So, do we have a deal? Yes, ma. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yes, Linda. Finally! Finally, I won an argument with you! <laughs> Gosh! Uh, that's simply because I wanted you to win. Oh, please! But you win anyway. Um, you win. Uh huh. Let me have. Thank, Thank you. you. And do have a nice apple. Thank you. Uh, madam, are you driving okay? Yes. Oh, I, I can help you. I can do that for you. Ada, go watch the gate. Don't worry. Okay. Bye. Just be safe, okay? I will, and you too. Bye. I'm 
Finally, try to give us some relief out today. Thank God. Jesus Christ. Hey! What's wrong with this idiot in this house, for goodness sake? Imagine what. What have I done to this house? What have I done to her in this house? Imagine what she gave. To a grown up man like me to eat this morning. Imagine. Mercy, what, what have I done to you? Eh? Mercy! 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 <laughs> Why are you shouting my name? Like, are you the one that gave me the name? Eh? Mercy? What is this? Mercy, what, what is this? Eh? You and I know that this thing you gave to me will not be enough for a five years old child. Yet you have the mind to give it to me. Listen, what have I done to you in this house? What have I done to you? Eh? I am tired of this nonsense in this house. I am tired, Mercy. Eh? Listen, I resign. Or are you meditating? Eh? Are you doing that? I resign. Are you thinking about it? I should resign. I am sorry to disappoint you because I'm not working for you. Yes. And I'm not working for you either. Adam, I'm not working for you. Eh? Is it because I did not fill your cup to the brim? And your hair vibrated. Mercy, mercy, mercy. I know mother want me to give you people big, big food so that you eat and get lazy. And laziness began poverty. And I cannot allow that in this house. Hmm? Mercy. Mercy, you better stop this nonsense in this house. Stop acting as if you're the one in charge. In someone's house. In a woman's house, not yours. Huh? Okay, Adam, I'm in charge for here. For this place, I'm in charge. The earlier you accept it, the better for all of us. I'm in charge. I'm going to... Foolish man. Uh, wait, wait. What I don't actually understand is this. Madam, she pays you very well. And she treats you like her own sister. Yet every now and then your body they pay very like someone that chicken needles all over. Wait, wait. Are you sure you're not a witch? <laughs> you are the witch! You are the international witch! You are papa! You can go with the food. You can go with it. Thank you. Thank you, Mercy. I don't need it anymore. Ha! Yes. I've lost my appetite. I don't need to eat your food again. Go eat it and get more bigger. Adam, you can go with it. What can you do? I am not doing anything. You can do nothing. You can go with your food. You, you can do Let nothing. Me see. I don't you can do nothing. I don't have your... There is nothing you can do. Eh? You slept this man. Idiot. Look at him. I will not carry the food. You will eat it. Because I know very soon that you will be hungry. I don't want you to die. So that my dad will say, Mercy, I've killed uh, uh, his guest man. You will eat it. You still come back and eat it. Foolish. You better come here and carry this video. I am not interested anymore, like you I said. Eat it. I don't Stop want it. it. You eat it. Enjoy it. Ah. Ah. Come and carry I'm, I, 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 I'm no longer interested. Come and carry your food. I don't want you to die. Eat it. Eat. What is wrong with this woman from Guinea? Why, why are you so wicked? In someone's house. And it's not as if there's no. No food is There's enough to, 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 to. There's enough. It's just out of wickedness. Just, just imagine. Can you imagine? Come and try this video. Auntie Mercy, you said it is best to eat small plates of food. 
Why are you eating full plates? I'm a worker since morning. Since morning. Auntie Mercy, it's a lie. You did not do anything. All you did was to carry cane and make me and my twin sister do all the housework. Hmm. So, you think telling you something this morning is not work. It's the biggest work somebody can do. Hmm? Oh, why me? Why am I even explaining myself to a small girl like you? Hmm. Cindy. Cindy. Yeah, I want more food though. So you're not challenging me in this house, Cindy. You're not challenging me. What? On your news? No. Look, I'm to make I said we should be eating small plate of food. Look, okay, she eating big. Plate of food with meat. I disobey you, Cindy. Hmm? Yes, sir. Demi Kane. Demi Kane! You want me? You want to be my life like this, sir? Cindy. On her back! What? You are disobeying me. You want me to flog my twin sister? Yes! Flog her! Six strokes! No, I can't flog her. See you next time. If you tell your mommy, I will kill you. And I will kill your sister too. I just warned you. Ah! Oh! Not a child. I know that could have been anti messy. I'm just respecting you, but I can see you don't deserve the respect you give you. Did you just say something to me? Nothing. That girl is up to something for her. But I must find out what it is. Then we shall see. God, I'm going to win you this game. Yeah! I won! <laughs> okay. So, what are we telling mommy? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? Auntie Mercy is wicked. And mom needs to know. I know, but Cindy. What we should do is that if mom is come back, we should tell mom to be coming home early. In that way, mom can see that Auntie Mercy is very wicked. But I'm hungry. And this game we're playing is not making sense. 
I'm not concentrating on this game. And she said, we're not eating tomorrow. I want to eat tomorrow. Cindy, don't worry. You're not be hungry tomorrow, yeah? Mm. But I'm hungry now. Okay, yeah, I think. Let me get you something in the kitchen. If Auntie Mercy catches you in the kitchen, don't worry, she won't do anything. She won't catch me, yeah? So, Then why did you take the food without my permission? I don't need the permission before taking food from my mother's food. Hey, give, give it to me. You will eat only when I say so. Anyway, the food is not for me. It's for my twin sister. And she swore that she was suffering because of hunger. Okay. I'll go ahead and tell her to faint. But when she faints, you need to call the doctor. And the doctor needs to call our mom. What do you think Mrs. Linda Okosisi, the branch manager of ITC Bank, will do when she finds out that one of her daughters fainted because of hunger? Hmm? So, Cindy! 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 Okay, fine. Take it. Eat it. Finish it. Eh? But there won't be TV for you tonight. Eat well. Yeah. You are too smart. You too. Will you be able to finish this food? I cannot finish it. We will eat it together. Okay. ta -da. <laughs> Cool. Wow, wonderful. <laughs> Adam. Our new car. Oh, yes, this is Gordon my new Lato. official car. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is beautiful. Nice, right? Oh, I'm so happy for you. I'm Thank so happy you. for you. Thank you. What about the one you left in the one your your Rika? Oh, I left it at the office. Oh. Sorry, I forgot your food flask. Oh, come on, forget it. You can bring it home anytime, any day. All right, I'll get it tomorrow for you. Hi, hi. You're welcome. Thank you. Um, please, don't tell me how tired I look, okay? I was only going to ask how was your day. Hectic as usual. But Adam, what do you expect now that I'm manager of the bank? You think I'll be able to have some free time? No way. It is worse. Oh, no. No, 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 Adam. I said no lectures. Anyway, you don't have to explain yourself to me. How my princess is doing? Sure, they're fine. I, they must be asleep by now. Asleep? Of course, it's late. Yeah. Oh, can't you hear the sound of Jane everywhere? It's late now. Oh, no. You see, I tried coming home early, but the traffic, the traffic is cruel in the evenings. But well, you don't really have to explain yourself to me. But you don't approve me. You're always judging me. No, I am not. You only think that I'm judging you because you're judging yourself. Anyway, like you said, you're tired for any lecture this evening. <laughs> oh, so why don't you go in, take your bath, look for what is and rest? Okay, thank you for the breakfast. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I will only accept your thanks on one condition. I'm tired, Ada. I, I know it's just going to take it. Just a few minutes. A minute? Is it because you want me to agree to this condition of yours? But, but you can see you're the one delaying your rest, not me. Oh. Fine. What is the condition? Okay, fine. That you will allow me to do this every morning. What? But. Okay. okay, okay, I accept, but if you have to be giving me breakfast every day, I have to provide the ingredients. <laughs> Deal? No, 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 no. It's non-negotiable. 
Do we have a deal? Fine. Fine? <laughs> yes! I won again! <laughs> and this time, you can't tell me or you can't claim you wanted me to win. Uh, no, you, 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 I did not. You won't fair and square. Fair and square? Oh, of course you did. <laughs> Good night. Good night. <laughs> to talk about. Mercy said you had no complaints. I asked her, you know. And to Mercy is... not aware of our complaint because we wish to speak with you. Okay. I'm listening. What is it? Mom, you know how, it's, how hard it is for you. But Mom, we miss you. Yes. We want to spend time with our mother, not a maid. I know. I know I've been busy with work. I miss you too. And I really want to spend some time with you too. Mommy, this is our summer holiday. Mommy, at least we can take two weeks leave so that we can be together. I know, my angels. I know. I know I've been very busy lately with work. And I'm truly sorry. Okay, you know what? Once things settle in the office, I will take my accumulated leave and we'll have all the time we need to have fun. Is that okay? Mom, this is what I've been saying for two years. Mom, you said when you become manager, you have time for us. But now it is worse. I know. That is why I implore Mercy to take care of you. We don't want her. 
I hate her. You hate her? What? Is Mercy not treating you right? She's wicked, mommy. She's wicked. Krista, what is your sister talking about? Is Mercy treating you bad? Mom, mom, Auntie Mercy is okay. It's just that Sid is angry because because Auntie Mercy is taking your role as a mother. Mom, we want you, not Auntie Mercy. I know. Listen, girls, it is not easy for me to. I know. That is why I have to work so hard to provide the best for you. What do you want me to do? Cindy? Krista? Tell your mother yesterday. Um, huh? um, Especially you, Cindy. If you tell your mother anything, I will kill you. Be down. Be down. Be down. If I hear you, do your ears. Do your ears. Do it. Do your hand. If I hear you, that leads to your mother. I will kill you. Aunt Mercy, what is the meaning of that lead? That lead is amiable, gossiping, blabbing, saying anything that's coming out of your mouth. Do you hear me? Mm -hmm. huh? I will kill you, both of you. What did I say? I will, I will kill, kill you. you. Idiot, shut up. What did I say? Idiot, shut up. I said I will kill you. Shut You remain here till evening. No food for you. Mm. Rubbish. Mm. Imbecile. <laughs> Idiot. That they say shall never end. They brought into this house to look after these innocent kids. But instead of that, you're practicing wickedness with them. Why, why this wickedness for goodness sake? spend some time with us. Mm -hmm. You should not have told her that Auntie Mercy was okay. If you have told her that she was this wicked, she would have fired her. Yes. I don't want mom to bring someone worse than Auntie Mercy. Don't forget, this was what happened when I reported Auntie Sarah to her. Auntie Sarah wasn't that wicked. She gave us food. And she did not make us do all the house chores. <laughs> I don't want mommy to bring someone worse than at this nasty. <laughs>
Wash it. Wash it. No. <laughs> Wash well. Start a shake it like a fish. I can't take this anymore. We are not the housemate. She is. Cindy, stop. Please. Please. You just, you just see. Where we I'm not watching again. I'm telling mommy. Cindy. What do you think you're doing? I'm doing my business. Wow. What I'm doing is my business. For oh, goodness sake, why are you this wicked? Why are you wicked? Why? why? Oh. Oh. Me wicked. Because I asked these two little brats to wash clothes for me. You call me wicked. Eh, pa? You. Let's see. Let's see. Madam paid you 40000 to look after these kids. But instead of you doing what you're you paid for, you starve them. You make them do all the harsh chores for goodness sake. What's wrong with you? How is that your business? I know. I know your problem. Adam, you want me to pamper them, spoil them. Mm? You want them to, to, to just be useless. Mm -mm. Not under my watch. You don't hear? Not on my watch. Peter Poo Poo, what is your problem? I want them to be useful. Not to eat, shit, and go to bed. You hear me? If they, have, if they have a problem with me, they should report me to the ma ma madam. You are not my madam. My madam hire me. Eh? Peter Poo Poo. Adam, next time you drag me because of this rubbish, I will, 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 God. God, what is wrong with women? For goodness sake, what is required of her is just to look after these kids. To make them comfortable in their mother's home. But no, she wouldn't do that. God, Taylor was not this bad when she was here. Her only problem is she was selling Madame's food stuff and giving them out. That's all. And also I remember that I warned her, but she said no, she was in charge. And here we are again. This one says she's in charge. Women. We men claiming both in another woman's house. God, just save us from their hands. God, I just pity this. I wish their mother knew what they are going through in their own house. I wish she knew. Messi locked the kitchen. Why is she mean to us? Mommy pays her well. And I've not seen mommy shout at her. Even once. People are naturally wicked. <laughs> okay. We should just enjoy it till mom comes back. Why are 
are you crying? I'm hungry. I can't be it anymore. And who are you calling? I'm calling mommy. Give me that phone. Give me. Give me the phone. You can't call mom. I will tell her. Please, Cindy, you can't call mommy. I'll call her. Let go, Miss Okada. No. Maybe we give us food. Uh, okay. Okada. Cindy is very hungry. And Auntie Mess will lock in the kitchen. Mm? Oh, Adam, do you have any food? Please, we're hungry. I'm sure I don't have. Okay. Give me your phone. I'm scared. No! Oh, come on. Oh, oh. What is wrong with the phone? Cindy wants to report Auntie Mess tomorrow. You can allow her to do that. What of if we report Aunt Messi to mom and mom sack Aunt Messi and meet someone who is worse? Chris Abel, at least allow her to report to mom first. No! Why Chris Abel? This is what happened when we reported Aunt Sarah to mom. We shouldn't have done it. If we report Aunt Messi to mom, mom will sack Aunt Messi and bring someone who is worse than her. Who we kill us, or rather, who we poison us? Ha, ah, Christabel. Oh, I'm hungry. I'm dying. No, Uncle Ada, please. Do you have any indomie? I'm sure I don't. Oh, what of money? Cause we can buy something. I don't have money, but I think I have a solution. You do. Yes, I do. But you have to promise me you're not going to let mommy know or Aunt Messi. Are you sure? Yes. Sure? Yes. Okay, uh -huh. I have this spare key to the kitchen. Then, go get it. Good, wow, wonderful. <laughs> Allah, here we are. Wow, wonderful.
I'm here for you. Anything you need, okay? I'll get it for you. Is that what you need? Yes. Water, right? Just water. Good. Wow. Wonderful. <laughs> I'm coming right to it. Yes. you to my dad. You go hear him, bag him for your head. Bag him, bag him, bag him. I saw you go hear him. Mercy, I was sleeping because I was very hungry. All the warmth in my stomach was almost killing me. So, so I had to lie my stomach on the ground so that they would at least let me live. Huh? Drama. Speak drama well, well. Go to dictionary. Find drama. Line them up. Speak and speak and speak for me. Eh? Hm. Because when madame come, and I'm going to hear him. Rubbish. Imbecile. Bad belly. Sleep off. <laughs> Sleep well. Bad belly. <laughs> Shasty naughty. You too. Imbecile. Your papa, your mama, everybody imbecile. Mad woman. <laughs> Very sweet. Uh -huh. Yes. Huh. No, and Messi can't cook that kind of indomie. Yes. This is why we have such indomie. Wow. Cindy! Christabel! Cindy! Christabel! Oh, God. So both of you were sleeping, and I've been knocking for hours. I was not sleeping, no. Eh? And you did hear me knock at the gate. I heard someone knocking, but since Okada was at the gate, I thought maybe it's not our own gate. That imbecile. He was sleeping on duty. He was sleeping? Yes. He was sleeping and I've been knocking for hours. He stood me at the gate, sleeping for hours. I want you to tell your mother how he stood me at the gate. Do you hear what I said? 
should I also tell her that we have not eaten since morning and it's past three? Cindy, you are finding my trouble. You are finding my trouble, Cindy. Christabel, did you hear what I said? Tell your mother that he stood me for hours at the gate. Auntie Mercy, you know I don't tell things. You do your own telling. If I'm to start tattling to my mom about our domestic stuff, like what my sister says, I will start with the fact that you starve us while you throw the food every day. Ha! Mercy! Mercy, how dare you? How dare you? I'm just saying my mind though. I'm just saying my mind. Okay. I think that both of you have gained against me. No problem. No problem. We shall see in this house. We shall see. This is food item. I'm going to cook and eat it there. We shall see. I'm telling. <laughs> Tell you what? We cannot be stealing food in our own house. Cindy, we are not stealing. Yes, we are. We are thieves. Cindy, stop. We can't tell mom. Why? You remember when you begged me not to tell mom about Auntie Sarah and I refused? Yes. And I'm still regretting. But what she was doing is wrong. Yes, but she never stabbed us. The mom sack her away and employ Auntie Mercy. She never dash her food out or sell them like Auntie Sarah. But she leave it, let them spoil while we starve. And Auntie Sarah never made us do all the house chores. Yes! I don't want mommy to send Auntie Mercy away then employ someone who is worse. No, nobody will be worse than her. She's heartless and I don't want to fall ill. Cindy! Nobody's falling ill. If our teammates is not around, I'll be the one cooking for us. Hmm? And don't forget, school will soon resume. No, she's paid to take care of us. Mom has the right to know. She's not doing her work. Cindy, stop! No, Crystal, I'm not listening to you anymore. Cindy! Cindy, come here! What is it again? It is Auntie Mercy. What about her? She stabs us. What? Christabel did not want to tell me the truth, but it's true. She stabs us, Mommy. Cindy, do you know what you're saying? Yes, Mommy. Go and wake Mercy for me. Tell her to come here right away. Yes, Mommy. Yes, ma'am. Mercy, tell me. Cindy said, said you starved them. What? Yes. And they are the ones doing the chores in this house. That's not true, ma'am. Yes. You starve us. Yes, ma'am. Sometimes I refuse to give them food, especially her. That's because she eats as many times as possible. And it is not right, ma'am. Uh, and sometimes I insist they do the house choice, especially washing of their clothes and plates. I thought I'm teaching them some values. She's lying, mommy. Mercy. Ma'am. Cindy and Krista 
are all I have in this house. I know, ma. They are the reason why I walk day and night. Yes. yes. So give them food as many times as they want. Yes, ma. Do I make myself clear? Yes, ma. But, ma. Don't bot me. Don't madam me. Do as I say. Yes, ma. You can go. Thank you, ma. Mommy, you believed her? Oh, Cindy, I am tired. You believed her against me? I shouldn't have bothered telling you. I should have listened to Christabel. Don't be surprised when we fall ill and the doctor says we are malnourished. Then you believe me. Fine. I will investigate the matter. I told you the truth, mommy. But baby, I believe you. No, you don't. Honey! How fast they grow. She went very early as usual. Mm. I can't wait for mommy to finally set in a new manager job. Then she'll spend more time with us. Cindy, you know that can never happen. How do you mean? Mom say when she's made manager, she will have time for us. But now it's worse. That is because she's still new in the manager thing. Don't worry, she spends her time with us. So. Well, anyway, you forget it. Have you changed your mind? About what? About selling me on and Messi. Oh, I already did. You did? When? How? How come? Last night. I set the alarm. Say, so wake me up. And what did she say? Hmm. Hmm. Mommy asked her. She lied. And mommy believed that instead of me. She did? Yes. Mom said she investigates the matter. But I know she only said that because she knew I was angry with her. Anyway, forget about it. Let me sweep here so that we we'll go outside and continue. I've been warning you in this house. Hello, is it right? Mess. Check. Mess. I've been warning you in this right? house. Right. Nuria is not red, she's black. Hey. He's less woman. Hey. Look at you, man. This girl. Me. Mess, let's mess it. You passed me. Oh, you've triggered me. You will die in this house. It's me and you. Ah! Christopher will bite me. Hey.
today was fun. Yes, like, yes, yes. <laughs> oh my love. Uh, uh, stop. stop what? Please, wait for me here. I need to talk to my good man. Please hurry up, okay? I'll be here waiting. Uh, oh, please, oh. <laughs> Make it fast, please. Adam. Yes, Linda. Hmm. What was that with the dinner you ordered for me at the office? Tell me it last night when you came back from work very late. No. And the night before that. Listen, Linda. You work so hard. Okay? And sometimes when you come home here, you forgot to eat. And there's no one in this house to remind you that you've not eaten anything. I'm an adult. I yes, know. I know that, Melidia. I know. But what I'm saying is that sometimes we need someone looking out for us. And that is exactly what I'm doing. I am just looking out for you. Okay, so you offer me breakfast before I leave the house, no matter how early. And then you order dinner for me, no matter how late I leave the office. What are you trying to do? At least I did not pay for it. Yeah, at least you had the sense to tell them to collect money from me when they deliver the food. I did not pay for it because I know you will object to it. That's true. Thank you very much. That is sweet of you, you know. You're welcome. So, are you guys back together? Oh, yes. We are back together. And you know what? He asked me to marry him. And I said yes. Well, I see. Mm -hmm. Well, um, congratulations. Thank you. But you don't sound happy for me. No, it's fine. For as long as you're happy with him. Oh, yes, I'm mind. happy. I'm happy. <laughs> That's fine. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Oh, sweetheart. Mm. I'm sorry for keeping you. Okay. Shall we now? Yeah, of course. I'm okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know. <laughs> hey. Mommy, you're back early. Oh, yes, my angel. I'm back early. How are you? Fine, mommy, you came back early. Oh, yes, I came back early. I'm so happy. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> and guess what? I have wonderful news for you. What news? You remember Uncle Kelvin? Yes, mom. Uncle Kelvin asked me to marry him. And I said yes! <laughs> so he's going to be your daddy. Isn't that wonderful? Krista, are you not happy for me? Of course, we are happy. Happy, congratulations. Give me a hug, give me a hug, thank you. You come, come give me a hug. You know what? We are going to be one big happy family. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited, I'm so excited. I'm getting married. <laughs> Cindy, Cindy, why are you crying? This is all my fault. If I did not complain about Auntie Mercy, she wouldn't have brought him. Wait, wait, wait. I don't understand. I thought she said they're no longer together. It is because I complained about Auntie Mercy. Do you think mommy paid him to be our daddy? No. I t maybe he love her. Yes, he truly love her. That is why he begged mom for him to marry her. And now they are together. We are supposed to be happy for her. No, he don't love her. 
All he cares about is the money. No, I think he loves her. That's why I asked mom to. Yes, ma'am. Good. He's my fiance now. So you answer to him when I'm not around. Okay? Do I make myself clear? Yes, ma'am. One more thing. I don't want to hear any complaints about you. Okay? Yes, ma'am. And tell Christabel and Cindy to turn off that music. It's too early. Yes, ma'am. Honey, come on, let's go. Forget what you said about Messi. Look, watch her closely. I really want to know if what Cindy is saying is true. You don't need to worry yourself, okay? I will take care of things about it. Thank you, my love. Mm. I have to run along now. Okay, babe. Alright. Oh. Take care of you. That way. Oh, you think I'm not good enough for her? Huh? Anyway, that's a problem. Do whatever I want to do. You'll be nothing but a gate man. Uh, I know your type. You're nothing but a good digger. <laughs> yes, that's what you are. <laughs> yes, I'm a good digger. I know so. But a handsome one at that. You, what are you? Eh? You are nothing. And nothing you will be. 
You're just nothing. Nothing. Ouch. And you wonder what this guy did to Madame that made her take him back. As you can see. Merci, merci. Anyway, um, I want to eat pandemia and um, salad soup. You got to prepare that for me right now. Yeah? Don't you think you are anything special in this house? In this place, you eat what I give you for here, dearest Kevin. <laughs> you make me laugh. Merci, merci. Merci, di merci. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> anyway, there's no problem. And uh, let me tell you, I, Kelvin, I will eat what I want you, Merci, to prepare. Get me? Else I'll tell my love that what her daughter is saying about you is true. And I know you wouldn't want that to happen. Hmm? <laughs> merci, merci. Merci, merci. Prepare me for the German and salad soup. <laughs> I knew it. I know that those little rats are responsible for this. Ha! Merci. She now employed that imbecile to be monitoring me. Cindy, I am not happy with you. And when I'm angry, somebody gets hurt. Oh, yeah. Oh, your news. No. Do not disobey me. Oh, your news. Leave her alone. Leave her. Okay. I said that both of you have gone mad. Mercy. Oh, your news. What is wrong with you and these kids? Let them be. After all, why haven't you gone to the market to get the things you need to prepare the food that I want to eat? Huh? Krista. Cindy, what would you like to eat? Jello fries and plantain. Krista, is that okay by you? <laughs> yes, sir. And what are you still waiting for? Don't think I'm going to prepare jello fries and plantain after preparing nsala soup with pounded yam. Mercy, that is what I expect you to do. After all, there are more than my love can afford it. Now, Cindy, Krista, get inside. Oh, come, thank you. Thank you. Mercy, and where is Adam? I don't know. He ought to be in his duty post. I'm not Adam. Now go and call him for me. I hear. Will you leave this place and call me Adam? I think it is good the way one brought Uncle Kevin here to take care of us. But why don't I feel happy about it? <laughs> because you are the prophetess of doom, and everybody knows that. <laughs> mm. Okay, I think we should just wait and see. Whatever you say, I'm going to our room. <laughs> This boy has triggered me. He came and be spoiling things for me. For here in my territory. Oh, why? Why can't he? What am I going to do? I will lock him up in one of these unused rooms. And when mother asked me, 
I'm that he left that an explanation. Missy, what are you saying? I want you just kill him. I should just kill him and be done with him. Like why? Huh? He's planning this for me. I kill him. I will go to jail. I'll be done with the rest of my life. Mr. Ting. You have to sit up because your days in this house are numbered. Okay? What is your problem with me? Huh? You're asking me what the problem is. Okay, I will tell you now. I saw the schedules of the twins and I found out you've not been teaching them anything, not even their schoolwork and their homework. Why? Kevin, you saw me working since morning. I've been working and working like Jackie. So? They said you to me. So what? See, you are being paid as a maid in this house and also as their lesson teacher. If you know you cannot do this both job, you say so. And let someone else be employed to take over this position. Eh? My love pay you 40k every month to do this job. Eh? And you sit and do nothing. It seems I'm going to discuss this with my love. I'm going to discuss it with her. Again? Yes, I'm going to discuss it with her. Kevin, of course. Or is there any other person? Acting as if he's the owner of the house. Is there any other person? What? How do you mean? Well, I don't know because I can only see one standing in front of me here. You mean me? Madam, how dare 
tell you, you are a very useless person. Imperitus, Nicompus, useless idiots. I don't blame you. I got that so low to come and to come and relate with you. I wanted to, uh, 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 to, 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 to operate with you and ask you that you don't have any operating blood in your vein. Nothing. I'm brought you up, but you have brought yourself down. Idiot. Anyway, I don't have your time. I will come and meet you at the, at the appropriate time. Idiot. Look at him. I'm bringing you up. You have brought yourself down. Monkey. <laughs> Oh, oh my God! Oh, okay. Oh, you're not happy the way Kevin is treating you, right? But you've been maltreating me, Adam, here in this house. This is just the beginning. It's just imagine, imagine, imagine. You want to come and start extending view with me? Me? It's just like him. You've not seen anything in this house. You've not seen anything. <laughs> <laughs> they say there's no peace for the weekend. You will never see peace in this house. Hey, sweetie. Hey, darling. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you, thank you. How was your day? Oh, fine. Just waiting for you. I know. So, where are my kids? Upstairs. Upstairs. Oh. Hey, my angel. I hope Uncle Kelvin took good care of you. Yes, Mommy, he's the best. Really? Wow. Thank you, sweetheart. Thank you so much. You're um, Well, why I am home early is because I will be traveling to Abuja first thing tomorrow. What? Yes. I'm sorry, sweetheart. Some emergency came up at the office. I, in one of our branches in Abuja, I was instructed to go there and help them sort it out. Hmm. So, how long will you be staying? Um, hopefully, three to four days. Honey. Sweetheart, I know. I know you have to go. We just got engaged. I was hoping we spend some time together. Sweetheart, I know, but I have to go. It's a job. But, Mommy, why tomorrow? Tomorrow is Saturday. And you know banks don't open on Saturday. I know that, my love. But you see, the manager wants us to meet over there by 1 p.m. tomorrow. That's why I have to go. <sighs> Mommy, please don't go. I know, baby. But see, Uncle Kelvin is here. He will take good care of you, okay? Yeah. I swear I will take care of them as if they are my own daughters. I know you will. I know you will. So, are we good? Crystal? Fine, Mom. Are you sure? Yes. Cindy? Yes. Okay. In that case, I'll just go upstairs, I'll change into something simple, then we all go out and get some ice cream. How about that? Oh. Yes, Mom. All right. I'll be back before you know it. I'll be traveling to Abuja first thing tomorrow morning. Yeah. So I want you to take good care of Kelvin and my daughters. Look here. I don't want to hear any reports about you. Yes, ma'am. Is that clear? Yes, ma my love, you don't need to worry yourself. Mm -hmm. I'll keep an eye on her. I'm sure she wouldn't want to lose her job. Thank you, honey. I know you will. You can go. Yes, 
so, my love. You have. Hope you're not going to spend much time this time around. Oh, no, 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 I won't. Oh, look, please take care of my daughters. Huh? I will there. Watch out for mercy for me. I must do that. My sweetheart. I will miss you. I will miss you too. I'm missing you already. Oh, you know I'll be back before you know it. <laughs> I'll stay long. Mercy. Mercy. What? You didn't iron my clothes. Huh? Ready to say something? I didn't think so. I want this clothes iron as soon as possible. Okay? Okay, I'm going to put it. Are you ready for this? 
your room now after care of assignment okay but uncle you say you play with us see yeah, our mom come back yes i said so but you have to go right now we'll continue this later in mm. the day okay mm. oh is it because we are we need you mm, it doesn't matter just go to your room right now go girls ah. please out What are you doing here? Have you finished doing everything I asked you to do? Yes. You finished washing of the plates? Yes. Scrubbing the ground? Mm. Everything? Yes. Can't you talk? Yes. yes. Good children. Now you go outside. From the beginning of this compound, to the end, after Ruby's gates, you scrub everything sparkling clean. Everything sparkling clean. What did I say? Scrub everywhere sparkling clean. Oh, it's messy. It's messy. We just finished sweeping the house, washing the old plates, scrubbing the floor. I know you're telling us to scrub the compound and wash the clothes. Are you not a woman? You should go out there and even wash the heap of clothes that I kept. Are you challenging my authority in this house? Eh? You will not do it. You will not do it. You will not do it. Quickly start. You must do it. Oh yeah. Come on. Go and do it. Go and do it. No more do it. Don't do anything. No more do it. You are not doing it. You are not doing it. You are not doing it. So, you want to spoil my plan? It will not work. Eh? Kevo! I'm coming to meet you in Madame's bed. Hmm? Enjoyment galon, whether they like it or not. Kevo! Kill me today. No kill me that. Kevo! You don't kill me that. But why did he join her? I don't know. I'm telling mommy when she returns. She just carry one more bucket to wash all these clothes here. Me, I'm not washing anything, no. Okay, then let's use the washing machine. You know, Auntie Messi never allows us to use the machine. Let's just try. Maybe Uncle Kevin will force Auntie Messi for us to use it. You think so? Let's watch and see. Okay. What 
Tem link na descrição. Ué, que tico. Are you sure they're not in her room? Where are you going to? To check. Go! Let's go make use of the washing machine first. Before she comes out. Yes. What did you study today? We study math, math English, English, education, and. Uh, um, 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 that's enough. Okay. So she studies still. Uh, it's okay. What you need to do now is just go in and uh, take off your uniform and take your bag and look for what you need, okay? Okay. I'll see you guys later. Be careful. Oh, happy trip. <laughs> You give me double message. Messi, I want to see that trouble today. I want to see that trouble. Thing were playing around the parlor, playing like small children. Who will add up playing such childish game? Uh, that's because. Uh... Uncle. Uncle Adam, do you have anything you need? I'm hungry. God, what does she know about adult hide and seek game? Lydia must do something about this idiot in her house. Uncle Adam. Uh, no, Cindy. Um, yes, I I have some biscuits. You do? Yes. Then go I get, get it. it. I and I also have some in ours. I don't want anything. Don't uh, yes, fast, fast. fast. Just calm down. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I Hey, 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 what's going on here? It's okay. I'm here. Come on, come on. 
get you a bottle. Yeah, you know. I'll help. Hey, uh, this is for you. I'll just manage this for now, okay? Show you time with this. Okay? Mm. Or do you like it? Yeah, I'm happy you like it. I told you he's going to be I found them! I found them! He's not responding and I can't see him. Uh -huh. Cindy, you must go to let him on the way, okay? Why? At least, not right away. We must wait and see how Oscar will behave when mom returns. But he will pretend as if everything is alright. Let's wait, okay? I don't want mom to worry for nothing. Okay. Okay, now let's go and eat.
I feel tired. It was hectic. Oh. When will it take out time from work to rest? I will if you stop lecturing me and let me go inside my house. <laughs> Let's not deceive ourselves. You and I know that you don't rest in there. You don't. Okay. I will. I promise. No. You know what I think? What? I think you need a keeper. Yes, you do. I have a keeper. <sighs> so you and Kelvin still don't see eye to eye. And I don't think we'll ever. And I don't think that will ever happen. Oh, here comes your angel. Hey, my angel. My baby. Mommy, you're welcome. Thank you. My angel. Wow, Mom, we miss, miss you. you. I missed you, oh, girls. Yeah. How was your day? Hope you've been nice. You've been good to have to make it. Yeah. Oh, honey. Sweetheart. You're back. You're welcome. Oh, thank you. You're looking beautiful. Thank you. I miss you. Miss you, honey. Miss you so much. Just missing you. Mm -hmm. I don't like him. Oh, I don't either. But well, don't let your mom hear this, okay? So she won't start worrying, okay? We will tell her, we promise. Cindy. Okay. Okay, just go in, okay? Everything will be fine. I promise you. Alright? Honey, this your traveling is becoming too much. Don't tell me you're traveling again. <laughs> no, I'm not traveling again. As a matter of fact, um, the problem at the branch office has been fixed. Hooray! Mm. Mm. Mom, that's good. I really miss you. <laughs> yes, we did. Didn't we? Going to the dress up like this. I want to put it in house. What? <laughs> Nancy. Uh, are you ashamed of me? No. Ah. Uh, Tell that I don't want people to see us and tell Lydia. See, Lydia has no friends. She does not have a social life. None of her colleagues know us. They don't know you, they don't know me. Let's go out so that you have fun. Or do you want to be caged here like this? The only reason she brought me in here is to look after those rats. Or don't you want to have a life? 
Go out, have fun, enjoy your life. Mm. You're right, Sue, you're right, you're right. Come on. I know you will disappoint me. Let me go in and change your but let's go. Uh -huh. mm. <laughs> I'll be right back, okay? <laughs> let's see. I will finish in this game. Let's you see know, what will happen then. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Cindy! Oh my god, no, oh my god. So... Wait, 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 wait. Ah! <laughs> wait, do what? Don't mind them, Kelvin. Mm. Let's go. It's enjoyment. Hello. Hello. Let me get it, okay? Come in. Okay. No cheating, man. No cheating. Okay. You are following me. Okay. If you talk, if you talk, I will tell you what you can do. Yeah, what are you guys doing? Hey, the food is Ah, I hope you're not cheating. I hope you're not doing something. No, I don't care about the food. I love you. I love you. Thank God. Thank Go on, go on and eat again. Okay? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Uncle Adam, mm -hmm. don't you eat? Oh, come on, go on and eat again. Okay. I, I have more than enough. Okay? Okay, let's take it before they come back. Come on, eat. They are not coming back any moment soon. Mm. Morris will be enterprise. This client wants to invest 50 million. And I've been trying to convince him. Just one document for him to sign, then we have the deal. <sighs> you mean 50 million? Yes, sir. Wow. And are you trying to say you don't know how to convince him to get this money invested into your bank? I'm trying. And do you know you can use this money for business and still later return it back to the bank account once transferred by this man? What is it? Ma'am, um, I came to check if there is anything else I'll do for you before going to bed. No, Mercy. She don't need anything for now. Even if she does, I'll get it for her. Yes, hmm? Mercy. You will. I don't need anything, okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. You can go. Yes, ma'am. What a maid. 
Leave Messi, she's only doing her job. Hmm, I see. Alright. So oh, sweetheart. Enough of all this work now. Let's go upstairs. Upstairs. We'll get some rest now. Okay. Bye, baby. Bye, baby. Mommy, why do you hate us so much? What? Cindy, how can you say that? First, you brought Auntie Mercy. She's evil. I told you, but you don't believe me. But Uncle Kevin said she's okay. That is because he likes her. Cindy, how do you mean? Mommy, they play together. Cindy, what are you saying? It is what I saw with my own eyes. They play all the time. Believe me or not, I'm saying the truth. I believe you, my dear. I believe you. Nothing. Cindy, what happened? Well, Christabel, I, I, I told mom that. Hi, babe. I'm sorry. Stop I'm... right there. Don't you touch me. Kelvin, I want you to go inside, get your things, and leave my house this minute. What? You heard me. What's going on, darling? What's wrong? What is wrong is you messing around with my maid! Kelvin! Where did you get such ridiculous ideas from? I told her what I saw. What you saw? Yes. I don't understand, Lydia. What did Cindy say she saw? I mean... She promised to get me into trouble for disciplining her. I never took her serious. I thought she was only being her age. Besides, what could she have said to you that would get me into trouble? See, Lydia, I don't have a problem living, okay? But I need an explanation. She said she saw I you. saw you and Auntie Mercy playing together all the time. What? Am I a kid to be playing around? But you and Mommy play all the time. Yes. That is because I love her. I love her. Cindy, you want me to apologize for disciplining you? I cannot do that. I cannot. I love you. Eh, I thought I could be your dad. See, every good dad disciplines his little ones for going wrong. But I guess you don't want such kind of dad. Lydia, I thought when you asked me to be their father, you gave me rights. 
to correct them when they are wrong. But I got it all wrong. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. I love you. And I love your daughters too. I'm sorry. I think I just have to go upstairs and pick up my things and get out of here. Cindy. Mom, I don't understand anything he's talking about. I told you to shut, shut up! What is wrong with the both of you? I won't have it in this house! Mom is lying! I said shut up! That's enough! That is enough! I don't want to hear it! I won't have it in this house! What is wrong with the both of you? Mom is lying! Shut up! Why is she mad at me? She's I'm lying. I, I'm telling her the truth. I know. Just leave it. He's a big liar. Lydia. Yes, baby. The kids. Oh, true. Cindy. Christabel. Cindy! Ma? Girls, come here. Come? Yeah. My angels, listen, I know you miss your daddy so much. And that is why I have been trying to work too hard to give you the attention you need. Look, I love Kelvin and I want to marry him. You might not like that, but he loves you. But mommy, no but, Cindy. Listen, I don't like the extent you girls are going just to get my attention. That has to stop now. And you, Christabel, both of you better behave. Yes, mommy. Cindy. Yes, mommy. My bag. My bag. Let me get my bag. Oh. My handbag. Get me my handbag. Baby, you need to make it proud. I think you left it on the dining room. Shut your hand. Will you stop it? You close it. Close it. I warned you not to say anything to me. You didn't listen. Look at it. Now she thinks you're a liar. And they're liars. Yes. 
sorry. Do you understand me? Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma Do you understand? Yes. Yes. So your hand, so your hand, raise your hand. Very yes. well. Very well. Now get out of my sight. Blue, get away from here. That will spoil our mood now. Um, huh? Cool. Wow. What Wonderful. <laughs> la, la. They think they are smart. They think we don't know. Cool. Wow. Well, yeah. Cool. Wow. Wonderful. Me too. We are wonderful. Cindy. Cindy. <laughs> we have to run away. We can't start story without a destination, Cindy. But we can't stay here either. Okay, I think we need to plan this. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. What is going on? Uncle Adam, we want to run away. Do you have any place we can run to? You want to run away? Okay, fine. Fine, come. We can talk about it, okay? Please. We can talk about it. Come on, you can run away. You can go with me to that point. Okay? I have a plan. What plan? I think it's time to fight back. Fight back? Yes. How? Look, first, we have to gather all the spear in this house. Then, we now play pranks on them. Pranks? Yes. What kind of prank? Look, your kids. And I'm sure you know kids love playing pranks on adults. So both of you should put your ideas together and come up with something good, okay? Hmm. I think I like it. Of course. They should be the ones to be scared of you. Not the both of you in your house. I think we have some spare key. Cindy, let's go get the many moves. Every of the key in this house gets everything for me. Let's I go. love you, Uncle Adam. I let's go, Cindy, fast! Lydia, I could break your neck for this. Imagine, can you imagine these kids? Uncle Adam? Yes! Or is it you? 
No! But Uncle Crocodile, I should. Adamu! Mumbai Adamu! 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 You will play with your blood. I will cut your own meat out of your flesh. Idiot. Again, messy. And I'm, I'm, and I'm, you're not going anywhere. Else. You're not going anywhere without oh, giving me where you step what I saw from the market. What is wrong with you? Thief, oh, oh, no, she, messy, thief, 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 let me be! Let Please. me be! Chief, Chief! What have I done Only. Here? Okay, but no problem. Adam, you can go. But let me warn you. Hmm? You can eat it. Because there will not be any food for you for this house, pa. No more food for you. Look at you. Go, 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 go. No more food for you in this house. Actually, as if the house is yours. Mm -hmm. Is it your house? Yes. Stupid woman. Adam. Adam, why, Adam? Adam, why? You are trying me for this place. You are trying me, me, Messi. Eh? No, you are daring the tail of a running lion. You are trying me, sure, you, sh sh Shut up. You, lion. Imagine. You better get out of my sight. Thief. Fool. Only. Stupid thief, woman. thief. So. Thief, thief. Thief, Don't thief. Only. Thief. Only. Carry out. Go. That's what you are. Thief, thief. Messi. What's going on? This thief. He stole half of what I bought from the market. Huh? Eh? Why, Pan? For this place. Miss, just let him be. Let him go. Eh? He is, it's like, he, he is not, it's like he don't know what I'm capable of doing. For this place. Eh? Anyway, he has forgotten that I am messless messy. No problem. But warn him. Warn him all uh, for this place. Pan. No problem, Mr. Badoria. What? Food is ready. Yeah. Aren't 
What you eating? Uh, what, what, what eating? eating? is ready. Yeah. Aren't you eating? Uh, what, what, what eating? eating?
House. They're not, I've checked everywhere, they're not around. Yes, oh, uh, they went out. To be a Oh, they went to visit Bear and her uh, siblings. Adam, what did they tell that they're going anywhere? Oh, they told me, and I called her Vera's mother and she confirmed it. What? Yes. Adam, they left without my permission. Mercy. What permission are you talking about? The last time I checked, you're neither their mother or donor of this house. And their mother has not forbidden them from leaving this house. So what permission are you talking about? Huh? Hi! Hey, Adam! Adam! You are looking for my trouble! Oh. You are looking for my trouble for this place, in this place! Adam! <laughs> permission, permission indeed. Imagine you. They will take permission from me before going out. It's all. 